Hi, I'm Diane Southard, founder of Your DNA Guide. On today's DNA Defined, we are going to talk about the generation of connection. Your generation of connection is the generation in your matches family tree where you should be looking to find your common ancestor. So when you're looking at a DNA match, it's often hard to figure out exactly how you're related. But by understanding your generation of connection, for example, if they're your second cousin, then you should be connecting with them at their great grandparent level. So that would be your generation of connection, which means if you're looking at their family tree and it's small, they maybe only have their parents listed, you'll need to build out their tree to the generation of connection, that great grandparent level, in order to figure out how you're related. The problem is you don't know which side of their family they're related on, so you'll have to build their tree and find all four of their great grandparent couples, probably, in order to figure out how you're connected. So keep this in mind that your generation of connection is the, is the generation in your matches tree where you find your connection. And then conversely, it's also the generation in your tree where you're going to find that connection. So connecting with your match means that sometimes you're going to have to go further back in their tree than you do in your tree. So it can be an uneven connection. But that generation of connection is where you and your match are going to come together and find your common ancestor. All right? All right, for more great tips like this, make sure you subscribe to our channel, and I'll see you next time here at Your DNA Guide.